Oh, I had to stop and refuel. I got a nice little salad. And I got some spaghetti. You can't see it because it's covered by sauce, Parmesan cheese, and cheese. But, oh yeah. About to go in. Peace. Be sure to check out some of my latest videos. One of my latest videos is Black Series Bad Batch Tech. You also have McFarlane's DC Aquaman. You scroll down and watch some of my favorite videos like McFarlane's Superboy Prime. You girls and guys be safe out there and I will catch you later. Peace. All right, so we're working on our X-Men animated series uh, run, right? So this is Sinister, we got Wolverine, and we got Jubilee. We need Storm, we need Jean Grey. I think I'm gonna get Morph, Comic Book Window talked me into getting Morph. Really didn't want to get him, uh, because I don't like the way Hasbro Pros gives you no warning. They just, when you pre-order, it just comes out and they just take the money. So you have to be aware at all times. Let's get into some action figures. Okay, here she is, Hasbro Post Storm. A lot of my sex things to interrupt the video. It comes as a VHS uh, tape. Very cool. That's the side. Here's the back. Uh, let's read it together. What does it say? With her weather manipulation power, Storm can summon lightning across the sky or gentle rain over a parched land. So, Professor X, when it got Storm, she was living a lie in this little country. She was being worshipped as a goddess, as the goddess Gaia. And uh, Professor X was like, uh, why are you lying? You're not, you are a goddess, but you are a mutant. So... There you have it. There's the uh, first appearance of uh, Storm and Giant Size X Men. Uh, but uh, let's get her out. All right, so here she is out of the package. It's pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? I'm not complaining. Uh, her cape's a little fidgety. You know, I'm not used to handling action figures outside of the box. The figure itself is pretty cool. Um, definitely had to have her for the collection to fit with, uh, you know, Jean Grey, Wolverine, um, Jubilee. It's just her bottom half feels so flimsy and her hair is like super, super heavy. But, uh, you know, it's kind of like, this is a storm from the, from the cartoon, Jesus Christ. It looks just like the cartoon, wow, this is awesome. It's even awesome seeing it up close. She comes with uh, some lightning effect hands. I don't too much care for that one. I really like the regular, you know, hands. And wow, I'm appreciating this figure more and more as I look at it. This is awesome. Wow, I was just getting ready to say how I didn't like it. Now I like it. So she's gonna go good in my storm collection. My storm collection is up on the wall right above my Ninja Turtles. So I'm probably gonna no, I can't put it up there, but I would like for her to be up there. So here she is side by side with Mr. Sinister. Very cool. Sinister towers over her. He's, I didn't notice that he was that much of a bigger uh, figure. Very cool. And here she is compared to her Diamond Select Gallery statue. Very, very cool. I'm definitely loving the store figure. I got so many figures I can freaking compare her to, but uh, this is awesome. What do you guys think? Very cool. And so, once again, I'd like to thank you guys and girls for tuning in to another episode of Direct Edition. The channel is Fred Hall, Direct Edition. Like, subscribe, share. Remember, words of wisdom. Focus on the ones that show you love and on the ones that don't show you love. Hey, we're just going to keep on rolling without them. The name of the channel is Fred Hall, Direct Edition. I will catch you girls and guys later. Be safe out there. Beezies. Hey, y'all stick around because I have the Hasbro Pulse uh, gene. We're going to do that one um, further down the line. Let's go.